hello and welcome back to my channel i am adoma Obukeme, and on this youtube channel i share everything from my faith to insight for teens and parents and about my life in south korea and you know, other things about life and uh, for the past seven days i've made six videos this is six one on gratitude talking about different aspects of gratitude in celebration of the thanksgiving day and so today is the last video in this trend of the gratitude challenge and i just want to talk about the things that i'm grateful for yes to end this what it's, it's beautiful right to talk about the things i'm grateful for so uh, i'm grateful first of all for the salvation of my soul and this is the most important thing because without god in my life i don't know where i would have been i look back sometimes like there are many mistakes i would have made i would have endangered my life but somehow god delivered me so i'm just grateful for god i'm grateful for god and for the beautiful things he's been doing in my life and i'm grateful for all the experiences i've had so far for my educational um experience and my own my life experience i'm grateful for my family and my this i'm grateful for my husband because he's a gift to me it's a, a gift a gift i cannot i can't explain because it's god has used him so many ways to push me to become a better person i'm grateful for my father i'm grateful for my brothers I'm grateful for my cousins, my nieces, my nephew, you know, all my siblings, all my extended family members, because they have been a constant source of support to me. I'm grateful for the gift of YouTube because with this YouTube channel, I've been able to reach people, be able to impart life. And I'm so grateful for it. I'm grateful for the ability to write, you know, and when I write my posts on Facebook, on Instagram, I receive messages from people. Oh, this post you wrote really blessed me. Uh, I'm grateful for that. It's, it's, I'm grateful to be a blessing. Really, I'm grateful to be a blessing that people read my posts and it resonates with them and they're grateful they have come in contact with my writings i'm really grateful for that i'm also grateful for the ability to write uh, i'm an author actually i write books and i also help people publish their books on amazon so i'm i'm grateful for that i'm grateful for that that privilege to do that you know i'm so grateful for the privilege to create so i've created some what such puzzles you know gratitude like some gr journals and lots of printables that inspirational and educational printables so i'm grateful for the abilities to you know conceive the idea and you know p make those things happen and people are using it and people are like oh i'm grateful for this resource so i'm really grateful for that 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 gift i'm really grateful for it i'm grateful for the mentors the coaches the teachers god has placed in my life you know in this season of my life i just feel like he has brought in people who has helped me to become a better person than i am i can't name all of them all the people god has brought in brought me in contact with i cannot name them they're too numerous account and they've shaped and uh, formed the the lady the beautiful lady you see here today right <sighs> i'm grateful for my life i'm grateful for the things god is using me to do and what he's set to do in my life so, uh, these are the things i'm grateful for what are you grateful for look around you what are you grateful for i'm also grateful for coffee shops really because sometimes i i when i um when i want to work sometimes i don't want to work at home and sometimes i don't want to go far to the library so the coffee shop is just that place where i just go and i sit down i'm able to do what i want to do so i'm grateful for the coffee shops I'm grateful for uh, you know um job opportunities for my life i'm grateful for for my name adoma 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 is a beautiful name for me it's uh, ada means daughter first daughter and oma means beautiful means pretty and i'm grateful for that understanding of my name because when i when i was growing i really didn't see myself as beautiful yeah but now I, i've come to know beautiful just is 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 more than the face yeah i've suffered from a lot of acne and it's still there but still i'm still beautiful because beauty radiates from my heart so i'm going for my name because really i am oh my i'm beauty if i said the first so i'm going for uh, all the things that god is teaching me about who i am really about my identity about 
you know, about not allowing labor as the family. Yeah, I'm writing a book on labor. This book has been, it's a short book, actually. I started writing this book last year, but is it last year or be the year before? It should be last day, but somehow I left it and really it's been nudging to continue to pick it up. So I'm picking it up. I, I, I hope before the end of this year, I get it out so that people can be blessed by it. So I'm grateful for that. <laughs> I'm grateful for everything he's been doing. I think I'm babbling. So that's enough. What are you grateful for? What is it? Look inside. Look inward. Look around. What are the things you're grateful for? I want to. I want to hear. I want to read from you. Really, I really want to read from you in the comment section. And you know, this video has blessed you. Please don't forget to write me. I love to read from you. So till I come your way next time. Next week, I'm going back to my normal schedule of videos. So <laughs> look forward to them. So till I come your way next time. Keep living intention now bye for now oh before i go off don't forget to like and subscribe to my youtube channel do not forget to like and subscribe to my youtube channel bye